here's some of the things I'll be working on over the winter. Um, I'm a little bit of an electronics uh, geek, so I'm going to be doing some programming and some electronic installation. So, for example, this is a little a display module. It has a rotating bezel. It has a it's green with touch, and it can be mounted easily with a hole so it'll run from you know nine to twenty four volts. And it has some I/O ports and uh, easy to program. Um, so I'm going to have one of these in each cabin and that will be linked to dimmable red and white lighting. So one way for red, one way for white. Uh, it'll show key boat data. So depth, speed, wind angle, wind speed, um, time to um, navigation details and on the display and I'll be doing a separate program several programs on this I'll have uh, five of these one in each cabin and uh, easily accessible um, and so anywhere you are you will just look up to see ah the winds increasing or okay we're we're uh, we need to uh, reef or the anchor is dragging or uh, everything is good so that's going to link to these. These are little lighting panels. So each one of these LEDs has its own little processing unit, each individual LED on here, and can be set to any color, any brightness. And that just has a simple connection that plugs into the back. So I have like five of these running off one of these. And um, I have some power supply modules. So these are little 12 volt to um, five volt, which will run the lighting and the uh, and I have some relay modules so in the kitchen you'll be able to say turn the kettle on for 15 minutes it'll automatically put the inverter on automatically turn the kettle on and then once it's detected it's finished it will turn off the inverter to save electricity and I also have where was it this which is an AC measuring device so this will measure current voltage frequency power factor uh, wattage on ac so each of my outlets will have one of these behind it and we so i'll have live uh measurement and control of uh, what my inverter and my shore power is being used for uh this is a eight block a four block relay so i'm going to be doing a digital boat control system using home assistant and that will link to lots of these, these to I squared C. Um, and uh, each, I can have like 16 of these. So I'm going to replace my analog control panel with the digital control panel in parallel. So anything I can switch, I can switch from any of these little things. These, or I can switch from my phone or remotely over the internet. Uh, I've got a Raspberry Pi 5. I'm going to be running Open Marine and Open CPN. And uh, I've got uh, all sorts of interesting bits and pieces in here. I've got uh, this one. This is going to be my remote anchor controller. So I've got um, my anchor is currently controlled on a cable that goes into the forward locker and a switch for up and down in the helm position so i'm also going to put wireless so i'm going to use one of these relay blocks and um going to connect into the helm position and be able to control it from anywhere in the boat wirelessly so i can lower the anchor i can raise the anchor i can switch i can also this will be linked to open cpn to gps so i can plot the position of the anchor and then I can draw any boat movement around it. And this has got a loud alarm. And it will beep if it goes outside the, the amount of anchor that I've right, lowered. Um, so it'll be sort of an anchor alarm and anchor remote control all in one. And it uses e-paper, so it's very low power. E-paper screen. And uh, again, it's very modular. Um, uh, so a lot of little interesting bits of electronics. I've also got this, which is a mesh-tastic node. 
So I'm looking at putting Meshtastic on my boat, and it's going to broadcast out statistics to say depth, um, anchor, good, anchor, bad. Um, so if you're on shore, you can have one of these, and then it will alert your phone um, through Meshtastic, which can go you know, several kilometers um, open, license-free, long-distance, meshed, wireless connectivity. Um, so I'm going to look at open sourcing all this and putting it all on GitHub. And uh, uh, I just love tech. <laughs> you can probably tell.